I got some awesome Peter Rabbit figures from Walmart. I'm going to open them immediately. Let's check them out. I really wanted to track down my Peter Rabbit playset from last year. It doesn't go with these toys. I don't even remember what company it's made by, but I really love it. Do check out that review. I'll try to link it at the end. These would look really cute in that playset, but I couldn't wait to track it down. I don't know who makes these. Is that Just Play? Just Play. Okay, they're made by Just Play. There are five of them. I hope that there's only five of them. I looked, I re-looked. I hope this is all of them. I don't want to waste any more time, I just want to open them. Now the strange thing is you could get these two characters on a carded package for $19. These are Canadian prices, mind you. And the figures by themselves were $7. Two sevens are 14 And plus you get the egg. So I don't understand the pricing. I thought they were like bigger ones for a while, but then I noticed that some of these characters are sitting down in their eggs. Usually you save when you buy a multi-pack. I guess I could give you a better look at the label. I haven't seen the movie. <laughs> this sure was a good one to open on my first go. This might be the cutest one. Oh, they have them protected even in a piece of plastic here. Oh, these are such good quality. I was kind of worried about paying the seven dollars for them really heavy look at its little coat so adorable you see they can sit down a little bit they've got little peg holes for if there were play sets and the arms move and the head twists and the legs move like that <laughs> look at his bum cute so adorbs let's put this guy right here it doesn't say their name on it or anything anywhere, does it? Official movie, merchandise, collect them all, three and up. I love myself a little piggy, let me tell ya. I really like Easter. It might be the chocolate. <laughs> He's kind of a mess. There's Velcro. Velvety jacket, piggity pig. There's his bum. His jacket got a little bit wrinkled in there. And that's his face. He's cute. I'll take off his jacket so we can see the bodies. Yeah, they're all gonna have the same body. That's what he looks like without it. There's his tail. Let's see, there's a faux shirt underneath. Let me know what their names are if you do know. And if you've seen the movie, do you recommend it? Let me know that as well. Jax makes really good quality toys, especially their dolls are usually Super good quality. So if it's not clear, these are all flocked. I was having a hard time getting his sleeves over his hands. I'm trying to straighten out his shirt, make him look more tidy. <laughs> there he is. A little oinker. So cute. The eggs are a really nice quality too. Can definitely use them again. Put other surprises in them. Store your figures in them. I remember asking last year if Peter Rabbit and Peter Cottontail were the same person, and apparently they are. This one is sitting down. Look how cute. Looks so good in red. I love the one ear up and the one ear down. I love the two ears down too. Man, these are adorable. Look at that cute face. You know what? They're the same height. Oh, if the ears are sticking up in the air. That is why that they have to sit them down. All right, next one. Oh, wow. Amazing. Look at the details in his outfit. He's got a little tie, a little jacket, and a little shirt and a little hat. A little mouse baby, I'm assuming. Oh, he is awesome. Again, he Velcros up the back. Same body, just a different tail. Love the little hat, and I love the little tie. Let me straighten it a bit, even though it's really cute that it's not straight. I don't know if I can straighten it, nor do I care, because of how cute it looks. <laughs> cute. 
All right, I think that means that the last one is definitely Peter. Peter Rabbit's popularity comes and goes. It might be more of a British thing, because there was a time in the 70s where there was a lot of Peter Rabbit going on. I think it might be from the early 1900s originally, I'm not sure. But as a baby, I had a lot of Peter Rabbit things going around. Plates and dishes and whatnot, and books. He is so cute. <laughs> I love the little clothes, and I love the weight of them. It feels like they could be made with metal, even. So cute. So oh cute. Do you have a favorite from today? I was gonna choose, but... <laughs> then I looked over at this guy, and I just love the colors and how cute he is. And then there's just something about the blue and how perfect and simple Peter is, and then this guy is so detailed, and I really love the pop of the red on this one, and this is a piggy. <laughs> there's, there's no way, there's no way I can decide. It's not happening. Maybe you can do better than me, and you can choose one. This was an excellent find. If you celebrate Easter, I hope you have a wonderful Easter holiday. If you don't celebrate Easter, I hope you have a wonderful holiday, or you take advantage of the Easter one, and indulge in chocolate if that is something that you also take part in, right? I hope you've liked this video, <laughs> and I hope you're subscribed. Share this where applicable, and uh, leave a comment below. I need to know if you've seen the movie. I need to know if you're interested in seeing the movie. Do you like the movie? Who are your favorite characters? And be sure to check out I think it was last year when I reviewed the play sets and the other little minifigures because they're so cute. It's really amazing stuff. I will try to leave links in the end here. We'll see you next time. Oh, please check out these other videos. Some great stuff here. Some really great stuff here.